Are you someone who is afraid to film in public? If yes, then keep watching because this will be you by the end of this video. So now I just film in public without a care because I'm confident about it. Hello you guys, welcome back to today's video, welcome back to my channel. So excited for today's video, I'm excited for every video. But more excited for today's one because it's an interesting topic. If you are someone who is trying to film in public, no matter the reason, it might be you also want to open your own channel or maybe just post videos online, maybe in any media. Or you just want to film in public to document your life. Nowadays, like many people are afraid to film in public and not only film in public but be themselves in public, wear whatever they want in public or do simply like simply do things that makes them happy because you know we care too much about people we don't even know. And also anxiety is a big thing. I know because I was someone who was very afraid to film in public. Taking out my camera, it was such a huge thing. Like it felt like a crime, which it isn't. I'm not annoying anyone, okay? I'm not I'm just filming myself. That shouldn't be anyone's problem, right? As long as I'm not shouting in the middle of the street trying to film a vlog, I think it's fine. What inspired me to film this video is that I have a few friends I was talking to and they were like, I'm very afraid to film in public. I have content ideas, like they, they said they have content ideas, but they're like, they just can't do it because they're afraid to film. I thought I'll make this video because I think it's not only my friend, but many people. And also I struggled with it. So I'm going to go point by point. So listen carefully. Okay. Let's go. The first point is identify the root of your problem, the root of your fear. It just means that identify what you are afraid of, what is stopping you from filming. Who are you afraid of and what are you afraid of exactly? Find that out. Take your time and analyze and find what is stopping you. It might be that you are afraid of getting judged. It might be you are afraid that you won't get support if you do it. Or you might get hit if you do it. Also, it might be possible that someone in your life is constantly demotivating you or giving you negative comments that is stopping you, okay? Or it might be just you. The problem might be just you. You don't have the confidence or you, you are the one giving yourself negative comments. So find the root of your problem. That's the first step. So the next point is work on your fear or prevent your fear. After you're done identifying what is the root of your problem, where your fear gen is generating from, if you're simply just afraid of you know, getting judged, know this that you're going to get judged no matter what. In your life, you're going to get judged in multiple stages of your life by multiple people and that is completely unavoidable. So do it, do what you love, at least that's going to make you happy. Have the I don't care, I don't give a damn attitude, okay? Have that attitude and that's the attitude that's going to help you out with everything. You don't need to care about people that are trying to put you down. Care about people who are constantly proud of you and are there for you. And think about it that if you do it, it's going to make those people happy. The most important thing, it's going to make you happy. If the problem is coming from someone you know, try to talk to them. Sometimes, you know, people do bad things with good intentions. Try to make peace with that person. And if it does not work, cut that person out of your life. Say goodbye to that person. Now, if the problem is rooting solely from inside you, either you're insecure or you don't have the confidence or you are giving yourself negative self-talk, work on that. Talk good to you, even if you don't feel it from the core. Do it. Start doing it. Eventually, you will start feeling that way. Everything that you have achieved in your life till now generated from a thought. And talk good to yourself. Motivate yourself, okay? Do it. And I will be here to motivate you once in a while as well. So. Alright, moving on to the third and I will say the most important step, which is take action. Simple, but might be hard at first. This step includes 
getting out of your comfort zone. The biggest advice that I can give you in this video is just do it. This entire point is just do it. You are afraid to film in public? Go in public and take out your camera, take out your phone, whatever you're trying to film in. Take it out and start. If it's really, really that of a problem to you, take someone with you who you know will motivate you constantly. But I will recommend you do it alone because it will be better for you. It won't make you dependent on anyone else. Go and just film. Just, just do it. I was afraid, very afraid to film in public. And I started doing it and I realized that no one really cares that much. People see and they mind their own business most of the times. Well, not always. Some do judge. Some be giving me, you know, looks. And that's fine. I don't really care. I forget about that once I come home anyways. When I feel like anxious to film in public, I think about this. Think about this. If you don't film that video, you come home. If you haven't filmed that video, you will just be like, okay, I should have just built up the courage and filmed the video. That was a great moment. I should have just documented it. I should have just filmed it. But if you do film that video, once you come home, you won't remember who was judging you. And that person who was judging you will eventually forget about you, that you ever existed anyways. Once you come home and you did film that video, you will be happy and you will be like, okay, great I filmed that video. You, you'll encourage yourself and you will feel happy and you'll feel confident. Like once you do it, you do it twice, you do it twice and that's how you slowly build the confidence. Confidence is something that is built over time. No one's born with it. So now I just film in public without a care because I'm confident about it. I always think that I am not going to remember who was looking at me and who was judging me when I was filming. I'm going to remember this video and I'm going to appreciate myself that I built up the courage to film the video. And I will just, you know, after a year, you will see that video and be like, oh my god, this was me a year ago. When you grow old, you, see, you will see that video and be like, okay, this was me when I was a teenager or whatever. Next point is, don't let the fear of the outcome or the results stop you. Don't be like, what if I don't make it? What if I fail? What if I don't become successful? It, it's fine. Come on. You got one life. Life is not about the results. Life is not about the outcome. Life is about the process. Don't say, I will be happy when I achieve the result. You will never be happy until you are happy in the process. And also, you never know if you're gonna win or lose if you don't start. And my last point is become confident. Be confident in what you do. It's the most important thing. Once you achieve the alpha level of confidence, no one, no one ever can put you down because you are so secure about yourself that you know what you're doing and you know why you're doing it. You don't feel like proving it to others what you're doing. Become so confident that no amount of negative talk can bring you down. If they put you down, do it more. If they hate you for doing something, do it more. Be happy in what you do and let them burn. So as long as you're happy in doing something, the good people in your life, the people that truly, you know, the true people in your life will always appreciate you and be proud of you and motivate you, encourage you to do it. And the people who are trying to constantly put you down are the ones that do not deserve you, okay? Do not deserve to be in your life. So that's the end of the video and I hope you guys enjoyed it and learned something from it and you will take the advices and, you know, do it. If you want me to elaborate any other topic or any topic from this video a little more, let me know down in the comments. I'll do it for you. Don't forget to subscribe because you don't want to miss my other videos, right? Obviously. Have a good day and go ahead, do it, film your video in, in public and do what you love, okay? Bye!